Hello my dear this is Ujjwal Kumar Sen and in this video tutorial you are going to I am you are going to learn of course I am going to share with you about V optimum and of course T optimum So let's get started what is V optimum and what is T optimum basically if you are studying you know uh, manufacturing uh, engineering manufacturing and the numerical problems then I must say you have like, gone through economics of metal cutting just like so what is it economics of metal cutting even I have already shared with you a couple of videos probably have watch or maybe you haven't watched I don't know you have watch or not but yes in case of economics of uh, economics of metal cutting we have few most important formulas but if we are talking about uh, economical manufacturing economical manufacturing then V optimum and T optimum play most important role and uh, you know this these two terms are interrelated to each other that is also most important I mean these two terms have interrelated to each other because according to Taylor's tool life what is state that according to Taylor's to life we have V to the power N is equal to constant sometimes we have also written C right so by seeing this equation you can say that V and T are both the terms are interrelated to each other right V for speed and T for time T is to life and N for exponent it is also known as to life exponent and C is constant right it is you know uh, it is most of the time given or not given that is depend on the question so if you are preparing this topic for numerical point of view then this is the video you need to watch all right so uh, you know in this tutorial I'm going to share with you these formulas actual interrelation and what are terms you need to learn I'm also just going to share with you so basically we can write this here also V optimum is equal to constant by T optimum we can see right we can write this sorry it's T optimum if we know T optimum is what what is the value what is T optimum then we can also know we can also come to know V optimum so most important thing is that we have to find out what is T optimum what is T optimum so then let me share with you there is a formula which we have used lot of times a lot of times we have used that is 1 by n minus 1 t c t plus m2 by m1 now probably you don't know what is n well i have already shared with you what is n and is to life exponent right and t c t is tool change time what is t c t it's tool change time and of course it should be in minutes this is tct and i have seen question in many question they haven't share what is tct so don't get confused in that if tct is not given in the question then just take it as zero because I have seen numerical problem as in complete examination there they haven't mentioned what is the value of TCT so for that case if that case you haven't practiced such type of problems then you may face problem in the examination okay so I'm sharing with you don't consider consider is at zero tool changing time okay now let's move forward to two other terms that is M1 M1 is you know what M1 is direct labor cost direct labor cost and you know this is here here you can make mistake you can make mistake what actually the in the question it probably given were hour per minute okay hour or minute if it is given hour rupees per hour basically given we have to convert that into rupees per minute they can give in hour okay if it is given in hour we have to convert in minute if it is given in minute then it's okay first of all in numerical problems here you will face a, a problem because you will not just uh, give concentration here you will give your full concentration to solve the question 
so what you have to do you have to think on this that you will not make mistake here you have to convert its unit into rupees per minute if it is given our uh, sorry uh, rupees per hour right i hope you understand it now let's move to the that one that is m2 what is m2 it's tool cost per regrind including depression so tool cost regrind you can say tool cost regrind so if we can find out this value then we can put this value here so we can find out the value of v optimum that is speed optimum as i have already shared with you v optimum and t optimum play most important role to uh, to manufacture product in very economical rate you know why why it is happening suppose that speed is optimum optimum means almost maximum that is the sufficient one so speed is optimum that means production would be production would be optimum okay if production would be optimum then cost would of the product cost of the product will be less will be less as compared to if the manufacturing process and manufacturing process is not economical now if tool life is also increasing that means the production cost is less so what will happen because of this process you can easily guess my dear what what it can be happen because of this if speed is more production is more t is more therefore productivity will be more productivity will be more and if all these terms i mean this term this term this term and this term these four terms all these four terms if all these four terms is more that means cost of the product will be decrease that's why we can provide product to customer in very reasonable price in very reasonable price so that's why you know in this way the company can make maximum profit the company can run its product in the market quite easily people will talk about their product because of course if someone is producing product then definitely they can grab it well that is not the reason i wanted to create this video i wanted to create this video to help you out right to help you to find out its value so v optimum and t optimum are most important first and second if you are preparing for gate okay if you are preparing for gate then in case of economics of metal cutting then you need to remember two other most important formulas because i have seen question ask about machining time what is the formula of this first of all to solve numerical problem formula is must without formula how could be possible you can solve the problem that's not possible isn't it so you need to learn the formula first and the best way to learn for thing about that is machining time machining time you know formula play most important like told you already so in case of machining time what is the formula machining time is equal to l y f into n so what is l length of machining that means the tool is traveling for which length it is known as l f is feed okay that most of the time feed is given mm per you know uh, feed rate if you are talking with an mm per time and what time maybe minute maybe second oh, that is that is dependent question right and now yeah if you are oh, sorry if you are talking about feed then it's you know mm per circulation I mean, mm per its unit is in mm per revolution if you are talking about feed it is mm or minute sorry mm or it is meter it is it would be in meter and n revolution per minute so here is the thing you need to learn if you are talking about I mean, if in the question they have asked to find out machining time then this is the formula but how they can relate it with other formula that is n because you know n is in rpm they can tell you velocity and you have to find out they can give you velocity and we have to find out n by using a relation that is you know v is equal to pi dn by 1000 we have in relation and by using this relation we can find out 
that n and n after finding out n we can put the value that formula in that formula that is l by f into n and from that we can easily find out machining time so in case of uh, economics of metal cutting uh, few things are most important just like machining time and uh, v optimum t optimum these things are really optimum uh, i mean really important in case of this topic i hope you understand what is v optimum what is t optimum and the extra one that is machining time and how they can relate uh, machining time with formula for finding out uh, speed of that machining process maybe spindle or maybe tool uh, maybe spindle or maybe you know work piece that is depend on the on which machine you are working right now so this is all about this v optimum t optimum and i hope you learned something thanks for watching see you soon in my next video bye bye